Josh Gibson of Braddock USA. So glad to have you on AM Buffalo this morning to talk about your new masks. And I think the idea was just to like have a little, you know, fun with the masks. You know, for people that know, we've been doing it for a year. So we figured why not just put some graphics on there? We haven't printed any graphics on any masks and we own a print shop. I had a client and a colleague at the print shop and he actually has the, the trademark. So we partnered uh, with him. <laughs> And he's, you know, he, he's doing all the artwork for us. And he's, you know, we're making officially licensed VHS, you know, uh, gear. That's wild. I mean, from somebody who actually remembers having to hit the record button on my favorite shows and have to carry one of those big VHS. There it is, the cameras. Yeah, exactly. This is kind of amazing for me. I'm just thinking to myself, this makes total sense for somebody, especially in the TV business, to just feel a little retro. You know, it's not just TV. I mean, if you look at um, like Facebook and Instagram, the 90s filters are really popular right now. You totally. know, the wavy, you know, uh, staticky videos, that's all from VHS. That was really what we had to deal with. So tell me exactly how people can get a hold of these. It's braddockusa.com. And we have a promo for your viewers, actually. If you use the code WKBW at checkout, we're giving 20% uh, off on all the VHS stuff. That's awesome. That's Actually on everything, on the whole site. What's the pricing on the masks? The masks, they ranged anywhere from like five bucks a mask all the way up to like, you know, $7, $8 a mask, but we sell them in packs. So these, these VHS masks come in three packs. Some of the other masks come in five packs. We sell 50 packs. And when you buy a 50 pack, it just brings the cost down a little bit, but they're reusable. And we also use the dry fit lining. How excited are you personally to be able to have the VHS logo on your masks? I mean, yeah, personally, you know, as a kid from the 80s and the 90s, it's, it's everything to me. I just love that logo. I love that whole world. You know, we were talking about having to record on a physical tape, uh, you know, the program you wanted to watch. And now people collect them. There's a whole subculture, you know, around collecting and sharing, uh, you know, videotapes with workout videos and very obscure instructional videos. And there's a film festival too, as well, that tours the country showing VHS tapes. So it's like a, it's a vibrant living subculture, you know? Thank you so much for being on AM Buffalo and talking about your masks today. This was really fun. Thanks for having me. Yeah, again, nice little uh, trip down memory lane, huh? Exactly. <laughs>